Hey YouTube, thank you for tuning into my channel today. I have a little reveal and unboxing on a couple of things that I got. I'll save the big one for last. But the first thing I wanted to show you was this piece here. And this is a toiletry slash cosmetic case that I got on Amazon. There really isn't a name for it, but I just wanted to share it because look at that. Look how cool that is. Very iridescent looking. It's a uh, plastic and uh, it is also transparent. So as you can see, it's hard to see, but you can see my fingers in there. So it's really cool. So you can see it, but you can't. Uh, I just thought it was really cool. Um, and that's what it looks like there. Just a fabulous piece. Uh, I don't remember who, what the brand is. I can link it down below if I remember who it is. I'll just check my order and put the link if you're interested. But it has a gold pull, gold plated or, you know, it'll, um, and the gold zipper that goes all the way around with black, the black um, fabric for the zipper. So it's black and gold, but I thought it was really cool. So that's what it looks like. Um, I don't have the measurements here. Um, but it's like 12 inches, I guess, across. And this is a couple inches that way. There's a little fold there, but you know, it doesn't really matter. Um, but it's really soft and the plastic's really hard. So um, if you're interested in this, uh, I will link it down below. Got it on Amazon. It was just something that was at the bottom of my feed. Uh, I saw it and I wanted a clear pouch. Um, not sure what I'm going to use this for. I might use it for toiletries on my upcoming trip. Um, or I might use it for my uh, cords, my all my cords that I put in. Um, I don't know yet, but I just thought it was really neat. So that's that. All right, so the next piece that I have is I got it the other day. I, I'm not going to do an unboxing. But this, this piece right here. It is the Louis Vuitton Grace Coddington uh, collaboration and it's the, with the dogs and cats. So there's a dog. I think that's a dog. Yeah, that's a dog up there. Um, and this is the small pouch. And on the back, there's the cats there. You can see it there. It's really cute. It's, it's really tiny. It's only like um, four inches, I guess. Four inches long and maybe three inches tall and the thickness is really short uh, not that thick at all but um and there's the cats right side so they're like laying on the back playing it's really cute and the uh the louis vuitton floors and the flowers kind of look like they're painted on it looks like they're, they're just hand painted on uh, it has the silver button there that says Louis Vuitton, I believe. If I can read it, uh, it says Louis Vuitton. Yes, it does. And when you open it up, it has the little orange with the little mice. Uh, it says Grace Coddington there. Uh, just really cute. It's not that big. You really can't store a lot in it. But the reason I got this piece was because of this. So I have a car fob. It was too big to store. Let's see what oh, I have it up here. So this is my four key clay here. Uh, but when I had keys on it, this was too big with the keys to really put in here com comfortably. Com see, so it, it's like, it's hard to close. It's not very, doesn't fit very well. So, um, you know, I had my keys in here and this I had to carry anyway, so I thought, well, I need to, I wanted to put it in something. And I was thinking, what could I get that was tiny? And uh, this piece was calling my name. So it fits right in like that. Perfect. And then it just snaps closed like that. So my key fob's in here. Um, I can uh, start the car without this, as long as this is on me or near me. I can start my car, unlock the doors and all that jazz. So um, I can remote start it with, uh, with using this and then just stick it in here. And then when I get in the car, I can unlock it and, and start it up uh, to start the car. 
So that's what I got this piece for. I can also put my house keys. Uh, I can't use this because obviously this is too big for this, but all I have really are three keys. Well, two keys and this fob. So I have the house key, the deadbolt key, and this. So I, that's all I carry. So I can actually put the key and the deadbolt key in here. Uh, I don't have it with me now, but I have a little chain with a gudetama, the lazy egg. Uh, so I carry all three. I just stick it in here and the Gude Tama charm sticks out here. So it's nice and cute. And if you know me, I like cuteness. So yeah, so that's this piece here. The Louis Vuitton. This is still available. I believe in stores. I got this pre-loved. Uh, but I just wanted this piece. I don't have the other side, but I, I kind of love it. All right, so that's that piece. Move this high. So... <laughs> All right, so now the final piece and the main reason for the video is I have an unboxing of this item here. Um, it is from Fashion File. So I, this came in today. Um, so let me get my scissors. I'll tell you the backstory. So I had, if you've seen my Instagram, I don't know if I made a video on it, but um, I, made, I had the kabass men's version okay this is gonna be loud so that up uh, i had the kabass men's version the one with the neon orange uh on it and i used it for a couple of times and it was just too big it was huge let me see here if i can drop this on so their fashion file it was just too big too heavy and i found myself not wanting to use it because it was just too much so I sold it and I am going on a trip and I wanted a nice tote bag to carry on the trip. Thought about getting a Neverfull, uh, but um, it wasn't speaking to me. This one kind of did. Uh, so with the funds that I got from the Gabas, I actually got two pieces from Fashion File. Uh, so as you can see, it has the, here's piece number one and piece number two. Uh, and they put in the little confetti here. Here's the receipt here. And the thank you. And I believe this is a calendar. No, oh, what is this? Yeah, it's a calendar. So yay, if you get it at the beginning of the year, you get a little fashion file calendar, which is always cool. So that's nice to have. Let me get the two pieces out and then put the box down. All right, so let me put this down. It's actually smaller than I thought it was going to be. All right, so the first piece that I got came in this here. It's the, it uses the new new. Uh, it came in the fashion file dust bag. Let me open this. This is actually a. Um, yeah, I, saw, I just saw it. I wasn't planning on getting this. I just saw it and I thought, huh, that looks interesting. So as you can tell, it's a Hermes please. Uh, and it's right there. If you can read it. Uh, so that the tag, once the tag is removed, it's yours. Well, it's not on, so I guess it's mine. Uh, but it's this piece here. It's a little bracelet. What is this called? The Swift Cham Chamonix. Oxford bracelet T and the T4 size. So what it is is just it's a reversible. I believe this is reversible. So it's brown or black. I can't tell with my lighting on one side. It's just a smooth calfskin leather, I believe it is. And on this side is a dark blue color. There. So if you can see it. I don't have any professional lighting or anything. And then the clasp is a, a silver um, clasp with the H yeah. and I don't know how this opens so I don't know let me figure it out oh you put, there's a little clasp there so you push down on that and it opens up like that and it's adjustable there's three holes where you can adjust it so yeah it is adjustable you just take this clasp off and switch it around and, uh, excuse me there's a I believe there's a cat in the fashion file box. But um, yeah, you just put it on here. And I believe you just put it on. 
in the hole, whichever hole you want. You can adjust it, shut the strap like that, and you have your bracelet. So either you can put this up, I guess, like this, or put it down so it's just the strap. I'll probably tend to wear it up, so because otherwise this will bang on the ground. But I don't know. And it was like I said, it's just something I saw. I wasn't planning on getting a bracelet, uh, but uh, the piece that I got was actually less, uh, co cost less than what I sold my bag for. So there was some extra funds here, and it comes with a little Hermes dust bag here, so you can just stick that in there. Yeah, that's cute. I like it. So it'll I'll add it to my bracelet collection and uh, we'll call it good, right? Yes. So that's uh, that piece there. Now on to the main piece. It came with, again, the uses the new new sticker. Let me um, sticker it. The fashion file dust bag. It comes with a file. I don't think I'm going to exchange this, but I have never seen this piece, so let me see. Yeah, there's a cat in there. All right. So if you hear noises, excuse the noise. All right. So let me open this up, undraw the string. It's kind of exciting, right? I pull the bag open. Ta-da! If you follow Fashion File, you've probably seen this piece. It is the, pull it out here, the garden party in the size, whatever size that is, the middle size, MM, I think. So this is what it looks like here. Garden parties, this is the toile, 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 negonda garden party 36 MM. Uh, so this is what it looks like here. It's in a orange color. It's not as orange as the Hermes box, but um, it is like a burnt orange color uh, with the uh, smooth leather handles. This was a really incredible price for what it is. It's a little dirty, but you know what? It's it's good that way. That way I, I don't worry about scratching it or anything. Uh, so yeah, that's the one side. Has the the hardware is nice and shiny there. It probably has some hair line, um, pin hair, pin, pin line. Uh, probably has some scratches on there. I haven't looked at it really close because I just opened it. Uh, duh. Uh, so there's the back side. Um, it's probably dirty. I'll probably, if anybody knows how to clean the canvas, I'll probably just wipe it down a little. I got some leather cleaner. I can clean this leather. So the leather, there's leather. It's lined with leather. So here's the leather here, which goes into the handlebar. It's really smooth. There's a calf skin, I think. Uh, the bottom here is leather. And then this is uh, the Hermes canvas that goes around. It snaps shut, so you can unsnap it to make it bigger. So, you know, it gets bigger like that. And you can unsnap the front. So it's, the snap is pretty secure, so you could, you know, like you've seen on many videos, get it bigger like that. Um, the inside, take that out. It's not bad. It's a little dirty, but um, that's what it looks like on the inside. It's a kind of the tannish canvas color, dark tan, which is good because uh, it'll hide the dirt. The bottom is just the underside of the leather bottom. So it's that orange, burnt orange color. So that's what it looks like there. There is no inside pocket on this one. It's just one big bucket like that. Uh, it's lined with the little leather going down the sides here, which is the back side of this. Uh, what else is there? Yeah, it's so, uh, if you wanna know how deep it is, let's see, I don't know. I can tell you though. Let's put the tape at the bottom of the bag. It's about, as I say, 10 inches. 10 inches deep, maybe, depending. If you have it open like that, so it's like 10 inches there. Um, and the, the snaps are really, it snaps really hard. So, if you heard that. Yeah, so it's uh, nice, it's, you know, it's two, short 
here to wear around uh, on your shoulder the because the, the drop is a little short it's not like the neverfull uh, what's the drop about six inches six and a half inch drop I guess something like that uh, so let's see there um, yeah so I got a little insert on this if you saw my Instagram so while you're looking at that I'll be right back so in anticipation of this piece I got this on Amazon like I said I'm gonna be traveling and I was afraid this wouldn't be secure because it's you know a wide open bucket so let me unsnap the snaps here uh, stick this down yeah it's it's really nice I like it it's, um, but I got this piece it's called bag bag bagel bag bagel so it's a bag in a bag it's bag bagel I got it on Amazon um, it arrived really quick it's a it's a nylon bag so it's not like um, that uh, oof, I forget the company name that everybody gets their inserts with this one is um, bag bagel bag bagel I think is the name but what I liked about it, it was it's uh, lightweight, pretty well, pretty lightweight because there's nylon, but it has a zip closure here, so you can. It has there's the the pull that's the company, so you just unzip it here, and it's just like has a mesh interior, um, with uh, dividers here, so you know it's not the most expensive thing in the world, but I think for the what I want to use it for, it'll serve its purpose. Now the question is, will it fit in the bag? It fit in the Neverfull, but we will see if, well, look at that, it does. So that's what it looks like. You know, it's gonna be hard because it's dark. Let me open, unzip this. So if you're traveling, you know, you have your bag, you can leave it open like that. It fits right in. You can probably close this up too, like that, if you wanted to. Makes it a little more difficult to get into the bag bagel. Well, maybe not. So there, it looks like that. Yeah, so it has some room to spare. I'm gonna open it up here. So there's a bag bag over there, inside the garden party, MM. You can zip this up. So just zip it up like that. And if you can see, it is nice and, I can try to get it in there, secure. So you can, if you wanted to, you can just Close it up, push that down, like so, like so, and done. So it's like a double security. So if you stick your hand in, you can't get anything out because it's secure within the secure, like that. So that was the main purpose of getting that. I can probably stick this in there too, if I wanted to. A pouch within a pouch within a pouch. A pouch, a bag, a pouch within a bag with, a pouch within a pouch within a bag, bag bagel. Right, right. All right. So yeah, this I probably can stick right in there like that, and it fits if I wanted to, you know, with other stuff. Um, I don't think I have anything else. I have a little pad here, right there that can probably fit. It's a Huawei, who's in big trouble, but their pad is working fine for me and I have they can steal all they want from me because I really don't have anything uh, so that can fit in like there like there too um, yeah so cool I'm pretty positive I'm gonna keep this tote it's a lot smaller than the cabass I can tell that for sure um, I didn't want a tall bag uh, I had the cabass mezzo piano I think it was the mezzo uh, when I went to Korea and it was just a little tall I find that I didn't want a tall bag so this one is shorter uh, I'm not gonna be you know it's um, not in pristine condition uh, and I'm gonna be I'm pretty rough on bags because I use them and that's I tend the ones I'm not sure of I'm really careful of but if I'm really sure I'm going to keep the bag, and then I, you know, I, I just use it with regular use because that's what bags are for. I'm not a collector or anything. 
So yeah, this is the garden party and the 36 mm with the bag bago organizer here. If you want this, I'll put the link on Amazon if you want to check it out as well. As well as this cosmetic pouch. And finally the little Hermes bracelet that I got uh, here. So that is my video. A lot of rambling, but you know, that's the way I operate. That's the way I roll. Uh, if you have any questions, you know what to do. Leave the comment down below. Uh, and um, I would tell you to hit the subscribe or hit the notification button. But you know what? It's do what you want because I don't up upload videos that often. So, you know, if you can, if you want, I appreciate it if you do. Uh, and, but I do appreciate you watching the video. So thank you. Have a great day, great evening, wherever you are. And um, if I do use this on my next trip, maybe I'll do a what's in my bag video. Um, because I want to know what I can pack in this bag, in this bag, and in this bag. So, a bag, a bag, and a bag, and a bracelet. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. Peace out. Bye.